I would say that soccer in Winkler has been birthed because of immigration. Soccer was basically unheard of. We had we had winter sports, whatever, but we never had uh, we never had soccer. Uh, obviously, they just scored, right? So that's kind of exciting. There's a lot of different nationalities. Lots of people move to Winkler. There's such variety in cultures now, and the dynamics have changed. It used to be all just hockey. Now, it's soccer too, to a bit for a big part. Hockey is still number one, but soccer is getting there. A lot of uh, families that moved from Germany, the children were involved in soccer because it's a huge part of German culture. So it gave them a place to meet and get to know other people and just do what they love to do. It helped a lot to just get integrated into the community. A couple of months ago, I think in March, I saw a post on Facebook um, because like then I wasn't uh, going to work and stuff because of my paperwork. So I needed something to do and I saw a post about training and stuff uh, and tryouts. So I decided to come and since March I've been with the guys here. So yeah, I've gotten to know these guys more than just uh, team players. I think it's a, a team with different people from different places. So that's been nice to to kind of be in a place where we are all coming from different places and just sharing our differences and stuff. So, yeah, it's been good. I'm reminded of the Tim Hortons commercial. It says a little taste of home. Uh, Johnny Reed sings it. That's in reality what, what soccer has done for the immigrant community in Winkler because soccer is a taste of home for them. And so that has become a part of what their identity is in Winkler. And we're able to adapt and ensure that they can play the game here and uh, and actually include people who have lived here for a long time. And, and that's exciting to see that people get together for a common cause and soccer happens to be the one.